Hey, so today I'm going to show you how to use your car with an inverter to power a fridge. So in this case, we already have our inverter set up. I have another video on how to set up and connect your inverter. And we can see now it's drawing a sustained wattage of about 120 watts. We're pulling in 13.5, 13.6 volts, and we're putting out 115 volts. This is a pure sine wave inverter. It's very good quality alternating current, very similar to what you'd have at your house. You don't want to use modified sine wave. Then we have a 100 foot or 80 foot extension cord. At the end of the extension cord is our extension cord reel where we have four outlets. One of the outlets is plugged into the chest freezer. This is an emergency backup freezer and it can be powered by a vehicle. In this case, at a half tank, we can power it for a few days. At a full tank, we can power it for probably five to seven days at low idle.